All right, all right, all right. Cheers, everyone. Jamal of here. Welcome back one more time on this evening to Battle Brothers, where we return to the old timers run on day 115, and we will fight some barbarians. Barbarians, and uh, if, if the game decides to, there we go. So uh, we had a we had a big fight against the noble army. Noble army where we lost Garikrandi, Puska and MRE. Uh, that was around like day 110 or something. And we have recovered from that now, found a couple of new brothers already, and uh, just waiting for the noble fight to noble war to end. We are heading south, but we heard a rumor. In the tavern that there, there might be barbarians here who uh, who stole an heirloom a long time ago. So uh, let's go here and see if we could get a named item or if we just have a nice fight against barbarians. So I think, uh, I, think I was all set for this already. Uh, yeah, I think we are, I think we are good and hopefully... Hopefully we get some of those barbarian javelins, not in our face, but after the fight into our pockets. Okay, four dogs, so that means 11 reavers. There's javelins. This guy needs to die. Okay, so we have access, access, access and javelin on this guy. Yeah, if we focus on this guy, he would drop the drop those. So uh, we'll go we'll go all in on him. And then uh, there's a lot of these hammers. These just destroy our armor. Uh, I don't know, just one mace. So pretty pretty good. And some of these guys have the heavier helmets, but a lot of these typical reavers with uh, not much. Not much to give. Uh, yeah, we want these javelin. Javelin, so let's go for this guy. I said, let's go for this guy. There we go. Now it's only one hit and we got him. Uh, I think I, I might actually give it to ASF. Because they can get... Um, Killing Frenzy and Berserk from that and kill the dog as well. So I'll wait with Ice Beam to see who we actually throw at. Uh, yeah, I don't necessarily want Kill but to be there. Taking hits from guys like this. On the other hand, do I want to just throw throw us right there to block these three? Might not want to do that. I think I will wait though, because I will stake step out of the way. Let's see, let's see if my plan works. Yeah, 80 83% for my plan to kill this guy, go berserk and kill the dog as well. But uh Unfortunately, we missed those. Uh, I could, however... Could, however, block this guy's attempts on... ...using those javelins by going at his face. We are gonna kill them with someone else, but that would uh, could jump in. See, I think you gotta stop these guys. So I'll go here. Okay, am I worried about anything in here? Uh, 
think I will go for the dog here. And since that's happened... You take these guys and you take those guys, then uh, you can stay in there. And uh, if we make... Yeah, let's do that. You jump in here. Let's go for that guy. step in here. That's fine. Let's really just keep it like that. It's alright. Uh, okay, so Sissy will hit this guy. I don't want this dog to jump. Actually, I don't like this guy throwing the, throwing the axes either. If Monkey Bag can just fit to fit to tank them that well, he doesn't really have to have the hits. Hmm. If Sissy gets this guy, he would hit this guy instead. So, why don't we start that already? And then... You're gonna step here to lock them in. And now we got that guy, and we got the javelins, and now a double kill. No, not that good. Okay. Maybe a kill in there, that's good. So this guy is free, so he will step and hit. It will hurt a little bit. Let's go tear the block away a little bit. B-Man can come in here and hit that guy. That's good. And we did have you still available. Still had you. I actually don't want to kill that dog. I would like to kill that guy. Can't get a good hit on them though. And you can still step in and stab. Okay. Now what? Let's go for that guy. It was a decent turn. I got my javelins, which was the main thing. Hey, Tiny Frog! Yes, you you did miss seven hours, so to speak. Oh, they throwed one of their own in the back. Ooh, that hurts. That was nasty hit. Uh, but that's why Monkey Wagon is there. To take those hits, and uh, if they die, that's... Uh, that is fine. Although, they can't take another one of those hits. That was a little bit too good. Uh... Yeah, and it was not even that lucky, 65 percenter. Alright, Ishak, yo, good night. Okay, let's see. This guy is kind of is out in the open, he can come and step in and hit. So let's go for them. 89% miss, always feels good. Let's see, a kill from this guy in the back. It's on that guy. And then maybe we finish with Mr. Sec. This gives us Berserk and Killing Frenzy to go against this guy, who's the actual dangerous one. Sunkmar can just stab this guy. We cleaver that guy. Sad 
actually be missed that one. Maybe stab that guy to death, that's good. So this guy needs to die and that guy's kind of a target there. This guy can't reach anyone unless I move. So if you would Sissy get this guy, it would be brilliant, thank you. I guess we might as well kill the dog as well. do with you. You have a smashed hand, you are staggered, and this guy will probably throw at you, let's be honest. Nice 32% chance. Yeah, there. Even the dog can kill monkey back in here. Okay, they are running. Running, so we got this. I already got what I wanted because I see axes there. I see one of the hammers. I got uh, I got the javelins earlier, so this is kind of kind of looking all right already. Let's wait with you. Guys running. This guy can pretty easily kill the dog, so not sure if that's worth it. Let's wait. Let's wait. Keys for switching weapon. Yeah, it's uh, it's a mod. Uh, there's the command exclamation exclamation uh, mods. If you uh, if you want to check them, I don't remember the name right now. But I have uh, I basically have that kind of mods that uh, add quality of life or such things in uh, in the game, but doesn't really change change the game otherwise. are here. Okay, 
Okay, good. Monkey wagon wagons did survive that, and we did get uh, heavy javelins, which was the big find there, so that's good. And got uh, some of these nice hammers, and no mazes that uh, we uh, we might end up using. But no, uh, no special famed named item, sadly. So, let's see. We could still, we could still use, like, um, easy, like, four stacks of javelins. So, uh, we need to fight, still keep on fighting these barbarians a little bit. Plus two. Well, their hit points are like super slow. Super low, I mean. So, those improved. Uh, I guess I will keep them Colossus. That could have prevented this kind of injury that they just, uh, just got. Yeah, we are doing we are doing just one more fight. I was supposed to stop like three hours ago, I guess. I think I will just go back and take that um, take that caravan down south. Yeah, it's uh, this this game is so fantastic. I ooh. Archery contest. Interesting. The mission mission got away, but this do we have witch hunters or such? Beast Slayer. Ooh, Beast Slayer is an interesting one. We're definitely getting that. Uh, cheap lumberjack. I think we will try that as well. Yeah, let's check this Beast Slayer. Beast Slayer, and uh, let's check the Lumberjack. We've gone down from Beaver at 30,000 at most. 30,000 at most, and we have uh, dived down from there. Uh, okay, the price is good enough. Price is good enough. Right, so we want to keep the want to keep at least one hammer. I will keep this mace. Sell those. That. I think I'm I think I'm okay with axes. I don't need to keep this. Also, do I have someone who's like randomly good at uh, throwing? Not from these guys. The killing mode could be, but they are building them into a tank. Then I had. Spoilers. I did have... Who was the guy? This guy. Thirsty man could throw stuff. And I still live without, live, live without those. And two. Oh, let me sell that. We'll buy those because we are able to sell them later. And this place restocked on... Tools, so we will get them, but it's fantastic. Okay. But let's check those brothers. I already already took a look at this guy. Let's see. Uh, 
it would be a good attacker, but we kind of have kind of have these kind of brothers already. You see, 68 starting HP is good. They have the impatience, so they uh, they go first on the first round. We have one of one other of those as, as well. 103 starting fatigue is good. 43 resolve is also good unless you want like a tank. Two stars on initiative kind of goes to waste unless you specifically go for some initiative build. Uh, rain star no use for that. So. Um, This guy could be, could be like a decent attacker. They could be like a dagger, dagger guy because they have a decent, decent, um, they have those initiative stars. Initiative makes them actually with uh, very specifically with this guy. This could be a dagger guy. Like haven't haven't really thought about making a dagger guy, but this guy could be. So what you want with the dagger is that they are like um, that they have high initiative, so that they go first and then they use like. Um, Use that speed. So uh, this this guy could be this guy could be a dagger bro. Kind of have those stats already. Interesting. I wasn't thinking of looking for looking for a bro like that, but uh, anyway. Mm, interesting guy. This guy came with the with the nets, which is nice. Could carry a could carry a net with us. Other stats. So this is the beast slayer. So what is that? Yeah, not great. Like anything like anything like that uh, just immediately sucks. Um, hit points is all right. Fatigue is okay. So resolve is really good. Sadly, it's not exactly what I'm looking for right now. So they are missing missing stats on the. Missing, st missing stars on the right hand side, which means that they uh, they can't be that good. So let's say if that uh, if this guy had um, if this guy had three stars in um, in the melee defense, that would immediately make them a little bit more interesting. Fatigue is a little bit lower as well. Okay, so this guy is not a keeper, sadly. Uh, that is not a. But uh, so that uh, that puts me at 19 pros in total, and kind of uh, have a lot of lot of guys there that I might not might not keep uh, specifically for hunters. Obviously, they can be they can be really good in uh, in ranged, but that's not what I not what I'm looking for. Uh, the, the compensation, I don't think it actually matters at all for the new recruits. They still keep doing it. But if you if you take a brother like someone from here and you um, you dismiss them and no don't pay compensation, it will lower the morale of the of the team. So uh, this goes down. But actually with the new guys, I don't think it actually matters. But I will still do it because it's only 10. Um, okay, but yeah, we are keeping this guy. 
Keeping this name, we uh, we will roll a name. So this guy is Lord Pele. Or something. Uh, yeah, we have these weapons that we need to kind of cycle, cycle now, depending on who goes in. I think actually. Escape is probably only one who's not going in. They are just just hanging in there because they they are a boyer, and we are hoping they would get. Uh, we are hoping they would get. Um, build a bow for us. I'm starting to be convinced that the dagger, if there's nothing on this slot, the game moves them there automatically. Yeah, because I, I keep... I want to have a dagger on this slot, like with these guys, but if the right hand, if the left hand side is empty, the game moves them there. Yeah, well, now I now I see that they are, they are doing that. Anyway, uh, this guy is obviously not the dagger pro yet, but they, uh, they can be. Bow, bow, ba -da -da, ba -da -da. Yes. Okay, but uh, there was a mission here that is now gone. That is now gone, so we can uh, we can go down south by ourselves. We uh, we got stocked on tools, tools and such we were hoping for. So let's go there. Hey, Celery Zuda. Thank you so much for the five months. Cheers for that. So let's head let's head south and see if there's missions on the way and uh, or something else. Or if we hear interesting interesting rumors. Okay, I think this is the same rumor we heard. But uh from this town, it's to the northeast, so we know that we have done that. Sell prices are good, so we could uh, cash in on these immediately. I think you'd get more money out of them uh, further, further south. We can have one more stack of uh, tools. So we will. We'll buy tools every time we can if we don't even care about the price. Don't want to run out of that. And. I will sell a couple of these here. We'll see if we can get more somewhere else. If the if the price is around the same, let's buy a little bit more food. Food. Let's check these missions. Uh, where are you going, Sterholz? You're probably not going there. Yeah, this could be if we would be going there instead of Valheim. Easily take that. Is this uh task for a little bit more? Simple follow the tracks, you know what? I right now I feel like feel like doing these kind of simple simple missions. So I don't mind if I ooh, is that a cell sword? Oh there's an oath taker here. I've uh, I've passed on the oath takers because they have uh, kind of I'm mostly 
mostly looking for a tank. And uh, these guys can't roll that high on the fatigue that I'm looking for. Um, it's another cell sword here. It would be a, it would be on the expensive side, obviously. Still, I, I have not seen a single head knight. I don't know where to look for them in this place. Yeah, let's um, let's do this. Nice, nice, simple mission here. Just something I I can do now after streaming seven and a half hours. This is the kind of mission mission you uh, feel like feel like doing. Okay, but I have a, I have a, all of these guys who I kind of need to need to level up, and too many too many pros here really. So I might might need to need to let some of them go at some point. Uh, we have a temple here. We do have a temple here. Let me actually take care of that hand. Then I might take you in. Might take you in and start leveling you up. And then, uh, and then we have Redact. It's one who I should really just, really just dismiss. So I don't know how I will get them. Okay, actually, let me let me check one thing. Like what if I, what if I make Redact wear a shield? Like they have like twenty five. Could actually turn them into a. Could turn them into a like a tanky guy. Because <laughs> with uh, with the shield shield they have a have a little bit of little bit of something. The problem, problem with uh, in here is that uh, they they will not surpass the throwers, and I don't need additional throwers, and I don't even need kind of a. If one of my actual throwers would die, I would like to replace them with something better. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I think I will do. So let's put let's put redact in, and uh, let's make them. Uh, so they could be because they have fast adaptation. They could be building a maze as well. Okay, so redact is now a zerg thrower. And we'll give them one of those axes because they can they can still do. Still do damage with that before they start tanking. So maybe that's like broad more in the terms of how I should have been using them uh, already. Some raiders, marksmen, thugs. Okay. Hopefully we don't fight in the forest. Okay. Uh, yeah, this this run is not on uh, YouTube yet. This this will be there eventually, but uh, this is not being posted there yet. The the run I have on YouTube, the Sun Bros run. 
that is from like 2021. Wait with you. Ouch. Oh, that is interesting. They consider themselves uh, the range super range superior power here, and they are not coming for us. Let's see if we uh if we could drop one of them. What do they think after that? Still not coming, eh? And this uh, snow is snow is a little bit annoying because it's uh, costs so much to move. Okay, now they are coming, and uh, when one of them engages. Everyone engages. Nice hits. Not wearing a helmet, which is often a mistake. Look at Ice Beam. That's nice.
chopping heads off. Whenever there's someone with bows, it's very nice because the bows don't go through the armor. So then someone like D-Man here with uh, insane armor, they, they are just throwing like clang, cling, clang on their armor. But when you have crossbowers, uh, then uh, there's always that armor, armor penetrating effect and uh, it's immediately so much more dangerous. Redact has been trusted with a spear and a shield, and uh, I will I will trust them to take some hits so that the others don't have to, and then uh, probably at some point, some point uh, take take make this biggest sacrifice for the company while doing that. Very good, very good, nice experience. Ooh, Zixi level us up to level 12. Our first, uh, what is it, like, uh, what are they called? They're not legendary levels, but uh, but anyway. Past 11, so we're not gonna get uh, perks, and I think all the stats increases are plus one. Maybe you just get one or something. This might actually be my very first level 12 ever so I don't think we got any in the in the Sun Pros run veteran level that's the word yes uh, okay, but this is face stepper so they're gonna get that they're gonna get that 
good rolls here as well, just across the board. Really nice. Really, really nice. I need that plus four. I think they are more or less set after that. And uh, I will give them the Colossus. Colossus, and basically we are kind of deciding face tappers build later. All these perks are kind of what I more or less want to have with anyone. And student just gets them uh, extra perk in the end. Or it replaced replaces student on level 11. Um... Yeah, let's. Um, so with level twelve, you don't get a perk, and you get uh, get just plus ones. Okay, so you kind of get to round up their uh, stats. So I don't think I will be touching their ranged skill. Maybe I will turn them a little bit more like a hybrid as they as they level up. Um, go towards that. So we will get like the melee defense up. We will get uh, melee skill up. Well, I guess I sh should increase this one because these these are already on the level where I want them to be. Uh, although sixty doesn't have recover, so that uh, that sucks a little bit. Uh, but ninety five sounds so good. So let's take let's take that. Okay, but yeah, first, first wealth. <clears throat> I've been keeping like a, like 40, 40 is the absolute minimum and 45 is where I want them to be. And uh, well, in this case, 60 does have this, so it increases it. But uh, if I get into a fight where the resolve really matters, I have a good banner who increases it for that plus 10. So that's why I'm going going with like a... maybe a little bit less resolve than some. And so far it's been working. We haven't really been uh, broken. But on the other hand, I haven't been really into the like really tough resolve fights like the undead. Where there's geists and such. We did have a uh, first two of yours. Anyone else you who were not here? I think it was about two hours ago. Uh, I fought a noble company of, of thirty guys or 20, 26 and some dogs, and uh, we lost we lost four guys in that two game back. No, we lost five guys and two came back. But uh, I went into that fight knowing that we are gonna lose someone. Um, it was just nice to see that we were able to take a big, uh, big noble party like that. Okay, and it's still the same we know about, or at least we think it, that's the same. Sell price is still fantastic. Cell sword, this is the old taker. 
the cell sword could be could be really good, but also they are kind of they are the kind that when I take them, when I take them, uh, I think right now I need to I need to lose some brothers. I need to lose some brothers before we uh before we hire. I need like a lot of hiring right now. So we need to. I would still like to get the drill sergeant. Little sudden, but we need to uh, we need to retire someone. So what I'm hoping for is that I uh, I get one of these one of these guys who uh, who I just don't want to dismiss. Redact Azrael. Uh, are they the only ones at the moment? Monkey wagon. I want one of these guys to uh, go down, but take a permanent injury, so that they can, they can, then I can throw them away to get the drill sergeant. So I don't want to throw machine out. Um, and uh, Sissy, Sissy basically just got better because they got brain damage. And they don't need the experience anymore. Yeah, let's um, let's head south. Let's head south and uh, see what we find in there. Through Talpa, and then um, I think we need to go do some a little bit more on the noble war, like fight a couple of fights, get some uh, get some caravans or something destroyed. Maybe ten. Uh, it's probably unholds. Uh, we're not gonna do any any of that right now. Just wait here and check the stores. Uh, right now I have um, I have the scout and the lookout, and then I have recruiter. And I would like to get maybe the drill sergeant because I have the guys in the reserve and they are getting uh, annoyed. So right now the drill sergeant would be a. But I think these two are like the basic. Because you move faster and um, you see further away and then this guy gets more gets more recruits every town so he's kind of nice nice to the point where I am right now because I'm looking for more guys uh, I will I'll buy those woods why that's ammunition. Ammunition and just one stack of food. Oh wait, is this the place with the kennel? Yes. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Let's get the armored ones. Sissy gets a dog, ASF already has one. Sundmar uh, can get a dog. I will buy those tools. I said, uh, this stage we are buying tools whenever we see them. Mason. Is the Mason similar? I think the farm hand can have the highest fatigue. So I think I will continue trying the farm hands. So what I'm looking for is someone with uh, high melee defense with stars and uh, fatigue so that I could have a heavy tank. 
So let's continue continue trying to find that. More or less needs to be like perfect stats. And this guy has exactly the fatigue I'm looking for. But kind of <laughs> exactly the opposite. Opposite when it, when it comes to traits and the stats. So uh, this guy, this guy can just run away. Run away right away. Okay, on our way here. Let's see. I think these guys are attacking the, this noble house, obviously. But we have been in good terms with both both these guys and also we are we are fighting the Wait, who are, who are you fighting for? Um, who are you fighting against? Ah, okay. We'll not do that. If it was against the house winter hall, we would do that. Nothing here, and the prices are not great. A lot of lot of stuff happening. There must be a witch hunter here. Witch hunters can be really good with like making hybrids. So they can have relatively good de defense on both ranged and melee. But uh, I'm not gonna roll on them right now. Lumberjacks are a little bit more expensive. But they are kind of similar to uh, kind of similar to the um, farm hands. So I will actually I will actually try this guy. Only four hundred. So let's see let's see what we get in here. Ooh. Oh, why is he why is his fatigue so low? Oh, he's almost there. Oh, this guy. This guy's. This guy's so close. This guy's so close. Oh, that fatigue. If they would have rolled to that like 115, I would have had my guy. This is almost, almost what I want. 102 is pretty good. It's pretty good. That's 4-4 with 2 is good. Uh, what is the trait? Spartan and Swift, okay. 53 0. He's, this guy's almost there. I think this is it. This guy is lacking a little bit on fatigue for what I what I'm looking for, but he's the closest I've seen. Closest I've seen. They they need to roll roll really well on that melee defense, but they uh, this guy could do it. Yeah, this is my this is my first guy. My first like actual tank. So forged because they will be uh, they will be having this uh, battle forged and. Um, this will not be like ultimate guy, ultimate guy, but they they will get close. So they will basically level up. Um, the thing is, like they they need a little bit of hit points. They will level up their melee defense every time, and uh, we will level up their um, we we'll level up their fatigue every time. And then we will choose between Resolve and HP. We will get the Resolve to like 60 or 70. Hit points to 80. And then this as high as possible. So that they can do shield walls and such as, as much as possible. And wear the heavy armor. And hoping for max rolls in there. Okay. Jesus. Only took... Uh, 
Well, I, I haven't been looking from the beginning, but I think I have been like actively looking for those kind of stats for like 60 days. Even, even close to that, that they have good melee defense and good fatigue. Even here, this one star on initiative, if this was on fatigue, this guy would be exactly right. Like if this star was there, we would already be there. But this is this is just on the level, not above it. Not like, oh my god, the best tank ever. But pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, let's see. See, did I name... I did name one of the MC, right? I didn't forget. Yes, I did. Yeah, the fatigue, like, if they... If this guy would have rolled the 115 that Lumberjack, Lumberjack can have, that would have done it. Or one star in there could have been good. Um, But yeah, just having that three star defense that gets them to that 35-40 uh, range that I want. We can, we can find better, but considering that this guy is a lumberjack, not some hedge knight or something, this is uh, this is fantastic. So uh, this guy will be... 2 meter Eric. I, li I like that name for my tank. <laughs> Absolutely love that name for a, for a tank. So 2, two meter Eric, but now our tank. So let's see. And we uh, we do want to let we do want to start leveling this guy up. Um, we want to start leveling them up. So I think and have that one. You should, you should have that one, and have that one. Okay. Yeah. Still, uh, we have a lot of, we have a lot of guys here, and eventually they will get like a. Uh, but actually, they are as long as we are keep, we keep visiting visiting cities, they kind of uh, they don't get uh, they don't get super annoyed yet. Yeah, so they are feeling useless in the resolve, but because we have uh, we have visited places, they are staying content. But uh, but yeah, uh, I already went quite a lot over time today, so I will I will call it a day there. So uh, we we found a found a good guy, found a good guy. So I will continue from here. Um, continue from here tomorrow for those of you watching right now, and uh, for those of you watching this on a later date on YouTube, you will of course find the next part on the playlist or on my channel. But, uh, but yeah, I will see you guys. See you guys tomorrow, um, tomorrow and Tuesday, two days of Battle Brothers, and then there will be a two two week two week break. But, uh, but yeah, everyone have a good night, great start to the new week, and I will see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.